I think the biggest impact has been the rise in energy costs. Um, since the Fukushima uh, disaster, Japan's fuel import bill has soared about 10 trillion Japanese yen. Um, uh, Japan has actually become the number one importer of LNG, uh, the number two importer of coal in the world, and the number three importer of oil. It imports an over 90 percent of its energy needs from overseas. And because of the weaker yen, that's put um, a big uh, dent in electricity costs as well. A lot of problems that transpired over the Japanese economy over the past three years, and then we have have the likes of Shinzo Abe more than a year into his administration trying to pump up the economy. Is it sufficient? Because we've seen sluggish growth in the last quarter of 2013 and a rising current account deficit. Exactly. I think uh, the Abe regime's hope was always to generate an export-led recovery via weaker yen. And I think where his expectations um, have been defied so far is the fact that because global demand remains weak um, and because there's been so much manufacturing that's been uh, offshored, uh, Japanese exports have been quite sluggish over the past year. So will the sluggishness continue as we approach this April 1st sales tax hike? I, we're, we're hoping that it will so that we can uh, transition from a consumption-led recovery to an export-led recovery. But I think given the tone of global demand, uh, exports will remain quite weak in the first half of 2014. And the best we can hope for is a gradual recovery from the second half of the year. Can we see some help from the Bank of Japan after its two-day policy meeting, easing monetary policy even further and pumping more cash into the economy? I think at today's meeting, they're going to keep uh, policy on hold. They're still waiting to see what the impact of the tax hike is. Uh, markets are expecting action in April, but I think they'll actually wait a bit further until July. They remain quite confident that inflation is trending in line with its expectations, and they're not going to want to move prematurely.